Hi there, this is Judy from PaperPalmTree.com and I have a different project for you today. This is a DIY shell dish that I made from an oyster shell and a scallop shell. And I think it's beautiful and wanted to share how I put this together. So I was out to dinner and had some oysters. I brought the shells home with me and I soaked them um, for 24 hours. You scrape all the stuff out and have to get all the barnacles off and you just soak them and leave them in bleach, bleach water. Um, and I left them for 24 hours and then I uh, rinsed them well and let them dry. And this is, um, this is what it looks like. So as you see, shells are, every shell is unique and this is not as deep as this one. And um, this could be used for um, rings or, um, I don't know, just a little something to put on, um, you know, a shelf. I just think it's beautiful. I have used on this one a metallic um, pen. Um, you can do gold leaf or whatever you want that. And, and I also used, um, for the gloss on there, I used this, this uh, spray clear um I don't know, what is it called? Uh, dries in minutes for metal, wood, and more. Uh, crystal clear, acrylic. So that's what I used. I just, once I had done the uh, gold rim, I sprayed the inside. Of course, I didn't do the outside. I love the organic nature that this has and uh, the matte uh, versus the gloss, and I think that's really pretty. So the adhesive that I used, I used... Um, a product that's been around a long time and I've used it for all kinds of things mainly shoes but it holds a lot of different um, things that it really has a good hold um, I also have used in the past on other projects E6000 and that also is a good adhesive but this one is the one I used on this shell so I'm going to show you how I put this together so I had just another shell I uh, found on the beach and um, what I did was I took a rolled up uh, dish towel and made a little cradle for this to sit in and you want to make sure that as the shell dries that that it is level so I kind of just manipulated the towel around um, this this shell obviously does not have a flat surface so the, the glue needs to create that surface for it to sit in. So let me show you how I put this glue in. And you need to do this in um, a well-ventilated area or outside. And I would suggest that wherever you do it, that you be able to just leave this to dry and not have to pick it back up. Uh, this, this glue I left for 24 hours before I handled this. So I'm going to do this on the largest... Um, or on the peak of this shell and I'm just going to put a big glue drop kind of right in the center there we go close that back up so I don't have to smell it and see how big that glue drop is and then I'm just going to push it right down onto the shell and let this oyster shell rest on the on the uh, dish towel. I'm going to let that dry for 24 hours, and um, I will come back and show you how I do the gold rim, and that I spray it with my um, acrylic crystal clear gloss. Okay, so we're back, and the glue has dried. This is nice and solid now. And so all I'm going to do is take, I have a metallic marker and from American Crafts. It's um, just a metallic ink. And I'm just going to go along the, just the nice little edge of, um, of this gold. Right around the edge of the, um, of the shiny part of the shell. And um, go as even as I can. And there's so many other types of um, gold leaves and things that you could put on this. Um, this is just what I had, and 
Um, I probably will try some other products when I do more of these, but uh, this is what I used on this first one I did. So um, I'm going to show you this. So let's try to make it even. I'll go around the rest of the perimeter. And it's just enough, I think, to add. It's not not too fussy. And uh, I don't know what it is about the interior of oyster shell. I just find beautiful. Okay, so that's all I'm going to do to that. And, and I'm just going to spritz it with just a little bit of this clear uh, acrylic. And again, you should do this in a... Um, well ventilated area, but it doesn't take much. Nice little coating of that. And that's the shell. So, oh. so this was the first one I did, and this is our second one. This um, this spray clear um, stuff dries quickly, so um, that should be done in not very long, but there is our little dish. Isn't that pretty? So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit the like button below and become a subscriber. I would appreciate it. And until next time, bye.